Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review for you this uh, tool sharpening station from Parkside available at Lille and uh, this review will be, it will be split in two parts, theoretical and practical. I have prepared uh, drills, some scissors to, to check how it's, uh, how it's uh, behaving and uh, on the beginning my quick judgment rather negative and if you want to know why stay to the end of the video so what you are paying for as well some basic features uh, power consumption <clears throat> it's uh, 65 watts no load rotation speed up to 6700 rpms uh, grinding wheel it's almost uh, 50 millimeters to be precise 49.5 millimeters uh, accessories included uh, diamond grill grind wheel and power cable of 2 meters. Those are basic features. Uh, you can as well adjust um, uh, grinding angle from 15 up to 50 degrees. Um, and in terms of sharpening of uh, drills, uh, you are allowed to, um, to, to sharp or use from 3 up to 10 millimeters. So, uh, I will use this uh, maximum um, value just to check how much space you have it. And why it's, uh, in my opinion, uh, or my quick uh, judgment was negative, because it looks like a toy. And uh, on the uh, on the downsides is as well this, uh, I would say, artificial uh, grinding uh, or. Um, diamond grinding wheel because I would rather expect to have a um, uh, stone instead of such uh, thing but um, okay um, so um, actually now what I need to do is change these um, accessories for uh, that uh, for the, the, the one that will allow me to sharp the uh, scissors because I, I'm planning to do it on the beginning so um, it's su super easy how to how to change this uh, attachment here you need to just uh, press on the on the bottom and you are releasing this uh, this part and it's like a plug and play and it's done and because everything is made out of plastic flimsy plastic uh, I don't trust it at all. Also, this uh, mounting mechanism for drills, it doesn't look, I don't want to say professional, but doesn't look, I would uh, trust it uh, and it will not withstand long. It's just a my opinion. The other features, I mean, the lightness, it's not a powerful de de device, so don't have to be. So let's plug it in. Remember, safety first, wear our glasses, safety glasses. It's very quiet, I would say. It's doing something, but not so much. And actually, I have a feeling that it's in the opposite way. And uh, actually, I cannot use it in the way that I would like to, because there's not so many space here. So maybe I'm wrong. So correct me in the comment section if it's. But first of all, this. Uh, 
diamond wheel doesn't do the job on simple scissors. Those are very, I would say, rubbish scissors. And even so, I'm uh, hardly doing something. So now let's change the attachment to a drill station, drill sharpening station. According to the manual, okay, let's use the drill for the concrete. Okay, it's maximum. I have a mixed feelings because I should have some kind of uh, freelinkness to to do so, but okay, only what I can do is adjusting the height. Let's try it. The angle it looks like this. In my opinion, it's rather damaging the, the drill instead of sharpening it. My my judgment, I can ju only I can confirm my judgment because um, actually I'm ending because um, I don't really believe or I don't see it's it's capable to to sharp it. As I mentioned, maybe I'm doing something wrong, but for drill sharpening. I saw or there are devices that you are just installing the drill into it uh, and for sharpening multi-tool uh, maybe after changing this part for the regular uh, stone it would be better but please take a closer look about how it's mounted so it's rather impossible to change it for the regular part uh, just to improve it and now we are getting into uh, the real thing I mean the spare parts uh, you will need to rely on Parkside on Lidl and because this uh, this thing I would say this thing it doesn't perform at least in my opinion I don't expect it will perform in the long run if you apply some force or you will use uh, uh, some kind of harder steel uh, you can easily damage this uh, uh, this uh, abrasing disc and you, what you're gonna do okay you you're gonna replace it and why you are replacing because it's not doing the job and it's like a catch-22 um, in my opinion it's a waste of money uh, better to, 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 to buy a regular uh, sharpening station with uh, two rotation wheels and be able to change them uh, for different grades instead of buying uh, this thing. It's, it's my opinion, I'm curious about yours. As always, thank you for watching, stay tuned and see you next time. Bye!